If you're having connection issues or network errors when trying to play Sons of the Forest multiplayer or online, then in this video I'll be showing you how you can fix those problems. So the first thing that we want to do is just ensure that we definitely got an internet connection. So I expect you probably have because you're able to actually launch the game, but in the bottom right hand corner of Windows, just hover over the network icon and just ensure it says internet access. So the next thing that you want to do is right click on the network icon and go open network and internet settings. And you now need to click on change adapter options. So you now need to right click on your network adapter and you then need to go disable. Once your network adapter has been disabled, go ahead and right click on it again and go enable. So this is just going to simply give your network adapter a refresh. Once it has been re-enabled and connected to the internet again, Go ahead and launch Steam and Sons of the Forest and see if that resolved the network issues you're having. So that does also bring me on to the next thing to do. If that didn't help, then go ahead and restart your computer. So it could just simply be that a service or something within Windows has become stuck or stopped working correctly. So by restarting Windows, it's going to give Windows a refresh which will again hopefully resolve that network issue that you'll have them with Sons of the Forest. So if that didn't help, then the next thing that you want to do is close all of this down and you now need to right click on the network icon in the bottom right hand corner and you then need to go troubleshoot problems. So Windows is now going to do some checks and see if it can detect the issue why you're having network problems. If it couldn't identify a problem like mine cannot, then that's absolutely fine. We can click on close the troubleshooter. However, if Windows did find an issue on your computer, then go through the troubleshoot to fix the issue. So we can now go ahead and click on close. So the next thing that you want to do is open up the start menu and you then need to type in CMD. You now need to right click on command prompt and go run as administrator. You now need to type in the following, ipconfig and then space forward slash flush DNS. You then need to press enter on your keyboard and once that has been flushed, go ahead and launch Sons of the Forest again and see if that resolved the connection issues you're having. If that didn't resolve the problem, then the next thing that you want to do is also ensure that your security software is not the problem. So if you have installed a third party security program on your Windows computer, then either put it to a passive or a game mode or if you don't have the option, then disable it. Once you've done that, launch the game again and see if you have the network error. If you don't, then you know you need to add the game to the whitelist or the exception list. So just keep in mind as well, while your security software is disabled, you might not be protected from security threats. So just be very careful there. So if you're using Windows Defender, then you want to open up the start menu and you then need to type in Windows Firewall. You then need to select Windows Defender Firewall. If you don't see the option, then just type in Windows Defender Firewall. And you then need to click on Allow an app or feature free Windows Defender Firewall. You then need to find the game in your games list. If you do not see Sons of the Forest in the list, then you need to click on Change Settings. You then need to click on Allow another app. And you then need to browse for the games.exe. So go to the location where you installed the game. Once you found the games.exe, click on add and then you need to ensure that private and public has a tick in the checkboxes. So then go ahead and launch the game again and see if that resolved the issue. If that didn't resolve the problem, then the next thing that we want to do is right click on the network icon in the bottom right hand corner and go open network and internet settings. You now need to click on change adapter options and you then need to right click on your network adapter and go properties. You then need to select Internet Protocol version 4 and go Properties and you now need to go use the following DNS server address and you then need to select the preferred DNS server and just simply type 1 and then 1, 1 and 1 and click on OK. This is now going to use the Cloudflare DNS so I will pop a link in the description below where you can read up a bit more about the Cloudflare DNS but this can resolve many network issues. So once you've done that, restart your computer and then try the game again. So that does now pretty much bring me to the end of the video. The only other thing that could also cause issues is if you're using a VPN service. 
So if you do have a VPN enabled in Windows, then try disabling it and then launching Sons of the Forest as well. And then if it works, then you know it's an issue with the VPN that you're currently using. So I will also pop a link in the description below to a guide that we have done, which I will add more methods to if I can think of any that I wasn't able to add to this video. If you did like this video, then click the like button below. And if you want to see more computer sluggish videos, then click that subscribe button. If you do subscribe, then I will see you in the next video.